What's up, yeah, Joe? Good morning. I want to do a quick video. I want to talk about this controller. This is something that got suggested to me with my chat. Uh, I gotta give a shout out to uh, Juan Caro, my buddy here. Like uh, he suggested this guy, uh, the eight bit doll, right? Now uh, before uh, I got into you know PC gaming, uh, I was really into my PlayStation, right? Uh, God of War was my favorite game to play, right? So I got used to having a um, PlayStation style controller. So at first, I bought myself one of these guys, right? This is by if yo, I don't know. I was like some inexpensive like uh, a PlayStation style controller, right? Just plastic. You can see how shiny it is. You see like the buttons here. They're like not real triggers, right? And uh, I mean it works, you know. And I had one before, but the thing is like out of anger frustration, I guess I slammed it or did something. I fucking broke one of the the trigger buttons. It wasn't working, so I had to get another one. And the thing about that is like uh, because uh, I was waiting for a new controller, I couldn't like play certain games, right? You know, God of War, for example, right? Like that game was designed for PlayStation, so a lot of like the overall game mechanics was designed for controller. I feel right. You can't play it with the mouse and keyboard, but like just I don't know something about it just it, it lacks. Right, you definitely need a damn, you definitely need a controller for those types of games, in my opinion. So I ordered this guy, and during my chat, like uh, I was suggested to, you know, give this guy a try instead. So I decided I'm gonna keep this one as a backup plan in case, for whatever reason, this one breaks, or if I want to like play with somebody else, and I got this, you know, controller just like as a backup because you know that's what happened. I broke one controller and I like, couldn't do anything until like I got another controller. So I'm like, or oh, whatever, just to be prepared kind of thing, you know. Actually, this controller that I got the eight bit doll. It's actually really fucking nice. It definitely comes in a better packaging situation. But first of all, most of all, like, you can see how much fucking cable they give you, right? I mean, like, this, you can see it's a good amount of fucking cable, right? So you don't have to, like, worry about it. Now, personally, I prefer, like, a wired controllers, mainly because I don't have to worry about dealing with, you know, power or, like, my signal being dropped or anything like that. And, you know, I just like having the, the wire, right? Also, for the most part, I play at my computer, so I'm, you know, pretty close by to my computer, so being wired is fine with me, right? Now, overall, this, like, controller, it feels nice, right? Now, they do have, like, other, you know, Xbox-style controllers, right? Like I said, I'm used to, like, the PlayStation-style controller, so this is what I got. So, um, you can see they have, like, multiple, these guys here on the side, these are buttons that you are able to, like, uh, assign for something, not exactly sure what. There is an input jack here for your mic, and you can, there's, like, even a switch that you can like turn on and off like the mic if you need it to right i also like the fact that you have two extra keys here in the back you know so when you're playing you can assign these to something you know when you're playing your video games uh you do have like uh the trigger style little buttons here on the side so you're playing your fps games and then you have your bumpers right yeah it feels it feels good you know it does feel really good right I don't know if you can probably can't see it on my camera, but it does have like a bit of a texture, so it doesn't feel like it slips around in your hand. The controls, the knobs actually feel very nice and good, you know. Also, like the buttons when you press them, they do feel nice. Like everything about this controller does feel good, and it's like pretty budget friendly. Like it was like forty six bucks, you know, like just around the fifty dollar area. Oh uh, yeah, they have like you know this guy, but they also have like you know the Xbox style layout of the controller. Uh, they actually have like uh, almost like a Nintendo style, you know controller you know if you want to play your retro games and shit like that uh they also have like you know wired wireless you know all the good stuff and like yeah they actually have a lot of cool products you know for controllers you know i only played this so far for one game session and overall i like the way it feels right and it's actually a good controller and i'm actually happy that i got suggested to try this guy right so i don't know if you guys want to like you know get yourself a controller that's pretty budget friendly in my opinion the 8-bit dough i think it's uh, not a bad choice there's a box 8-bit dope <laughs> So, I don't know, just a quick video. I do like the feel out of it compared to like the other shit I got. This thing in the past, like having the triggers, it does feel good. I like it. And I also do like the fact that you have extra like buttons here on the, on the back. So, if you want to sign it for something else, then you can, right? So, a bit dull. Good controller. I suggest it. And I thank uh, Juan Caro for giving me the suggestion to uh, get this controller, you know. Right? So, that's all I have to say about this. Thanks for uh, watching. Take care and peace.